Hey guys and welcome to my channel. We are Monday. It is 10.13 and I find myself all alone at the house today, which is rare because usually there's always somebody in the house. Um, obviously I have Liv with me and she's just hanging out here. One thing I've noticed, she is super, super, super anxious when I leave a room um, when I, um, like, let's say she's in the bathtub and I literally just stand up like right next to the bathtub because obviously I, you don't leave your baby alone. Um, she just panics. Thought that the anxiety, separation anxiety came later, but for Liv it's coming a lot sooner than I expected. So I'm starting a new, um, a new series on my channel. Hold on, let me set you guys up. So this series is going to be all about weight loss. It's called I'm Losing It because I'm losing it um, physically in terms of weight loss. I'm losing it emotionally and you can take that in like many different ways. I'm losing it in the sense like I'm losing my mind because diets are freaking hard and I've done this like a billion times before and I'll share more of my story on those episodes so please go watch the series I'm gonna be posting the first video very very soon if not already posted and it'll basically just be like what I ate in the day and then kind of just have a discussion and things like that um, the subjects that are gonna be there are really gonna be about mental health because essentially I gain weight because of my anxiety medication and so I think a lot of people are in my position also and I think it's important to talk about mental health so we're gonna be talking about mental health about lifestyle changes and just like a raw footage because it's not always that pretty like you're you know sometimes the kitchen is a mess and I don't have time to clean it but I need to still make something to eat and so aesthetically it's not gonna look always so beautiful Obviously, it's not disgusting, but <laughs> but um, yeah, she's <laughs> but um, yeah, and I'm losing it in the sense of emotionally because there's a lot of emotions that go into um, your journey for weight loss, and then I'm losing it in the sense sometimes as a mother, sometimes you're so stressed and you just got a billion and one things to do, so you're like you're losing it. And so I feel like this was the perfect name. It's actually my mom that came up with this name for the series. And I feel like you can take that title and interpret it in many different ways. And so it's called I'm Losing It. So I'm gonna go and make myself something to eat. I'm gonna make Liv something to eat. I have the hardest time in the morning because I hate to eat in the morning. Like what I did was I just had a really fast banana um, because I live woke up drenched in pee, so I had to give her a bath and all that and so I didn't really have time but I Honestly was just gonna skip breakfast altogether and just have the banana and I said, you know what? Let's eat like properly So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna eat properly I'm gonna prepare live her cereal with fruit and I'm going to prepare my oatmeal with cinnamon and This is gonna be the start so this is what I look like. Automatically, I'm, the first thoughts that come into my mind are that I'm very ashamed and feel very, very self-conscious. And I think it's important to, um, to be raw about this. I don't feel good about myself. I'm in no way shaming women who are smaller or bigger or anything, but I personally don't feel happy. So I think when you personally don't feel happy is when you know that you have to make a change in your life. And so, yeah, we are starting a change.
ready, babe? Are you ready? Oh, you like your cereal. Mm, yummy. Yummy. Is that good? I'm thinking to do a smoothie for myself. A protein smoothie. I think that would be a nice breakfast. Yeah. Should we do a protein smoothie, Liv? Yeah. <laughs> okay, she's getting distracted by you guys, so I gotta go. Bye. Why do I always feel like every time I finish a video, she makes a poop and I vlog about her making a poop? Like, every, it never fails. But it's such a beautiful sunny day out. I'm thinking to take a walk, but I think it might be a bit too cold to take a walk. Because minus one is a bit cold still. She's still, she's still baby. You're still baby. Yeah. We'll see. So, I, <laughs> I literally just now, I'm sitting down to have my coffee. And it feels so good. <laughs> You know how I said before that um, I'm gonna possibly make a smoothie or um, I'm gonna, I don't know, make like some oatmeal or whatever. <sighs> I didn't have the time. Look, we're 11 o'clock right now. I don't know if you could see that. We're 11 o'clock right now and I literally, I'm just sitting down for my coffee. And I'm gonna be honest, I'm just gonna like, I had a quick banana and I think I'm just gonna wait till lunch. Which is not the healthiest thing, I know. I think that ideally, if I can get myself like some protein bars or um, make like overnight oats or um, something that I can just quickly put in the microwave or just quickly grab and eat, that's the ideal thing because I often find myself, um, if I'm rushing for an appointment or whatever, I just grab a granola bar, but I'd rather grab a protein bar and uh, or like a fruit or whatever but that's my biggest thing that I need to work on is that I do not eat enough